50-year-old Dean Penny in the Cornerbrook Courthouse this afternoon, sullen, looking up once to see his oldest daughter, Marina Goodyear, who was watching him with her friends and family. It's just, you can't just pick one emotion. Um, it's a lot, it's heavy, obviously, but it's, today is, today is freeing. Penny has been charged with killing Jennifer Hillier Penny on November 30th, 2016. He was arrested in Deer Lake on Saturday afternoon and is in custody tonight. The arrest and charge just confirm what Goodyear has believed for a very long time. The man that killed my mom is going to jail. I'm confident in that. And this is the start. Jennifer Hillier Penny was last seen at Penny's house on Husky Drive in St. Anthony seven years ago. She had moved out, the beginnings of a separation, but was staying at the family home to watch her youngest daughter, Dina, while Penny went duck hunting in Northwest Arm. RCMP said Saturday at a press conference in St. John's that her remains still haven't been found, and investigators continue to look for her. After seven years, Goodyear believed the investigation was over, saying it was hard to hold on to hope. But something changed, she said, and the police finally got what they needed to arrest and charge Penny. I can't get into the specifics of this particular investigation on how we ended where we did, simply because the matter is still before the court. But any investigation where we're going to charge somebody with first-degree murder um, requires a significant amount of evidence to support that charge. Um, there can be any number of factors that would have an impact on the complexity of that investigation and our ability to collect the evidence that we required. Goodyear, who's now a mom, has said to CBC that her mother was afraid of Penny, afraid he might hurt her. My mom's fear is what makes me not afraid. Anytime I've ever felt afraid, I have thought back to what she went through on that night and I'm not afraid of anything. She is my strength. Goodyear and about a dozen members of Jennifer Hillier Penny's family were in the courthouse today and they plan on being back here Friday morning at 11 a.m. when Penny will be before the judge again. They say they have waited years for this and they want to see justice for Jennifer Hillier Penny. Colleen Connors, CBC News, Corner Brook.